Okay, hi, hello, hey. So I'm dumb, and I forgot that I recorded last night, and that tonight and today I needed to stream. That I needed to stream Ring Fit, so I'm still kind of getting set up. For a change of pace, I actually feel somewhat normal, somewhat attentive, somewhat able to do what I need to do. <laughs> Perfect timing. Start it back up. Start it back up. Don't use those, use the Joy-Cons, you mini. Okay, I put my headphones over there, good. So yeah, just a... Oh. That's neat, they added little things onto the home menu here. Crank that up. Now I need the leg strap. <sighs> I forgot to change stuff on Twitch, didn't I? You know what? I'll leave it as is, because we're still in the robot area. Alright, anyway. Ring Fit is in the system. Let's get everything all set up on my end so I can actually stream it properly. Listen, man, I didn't have a game plan. I just pushed, re I just pushed start stream and went. Move to the left. Then when I tighten it, it will be all the way right. Need to get the ring, so excuse me for one minute. There, I have acquired one ring. <sighs> yeah. Hold on, give me one minute. Listen, I will say it clearly and bluntly. <sighs> Fuck allergies. Okay, stand here, right about here. So it'll be aligned. There, perfect. Wake up tip and go Keep for a stretch. Your posture straight. Three, the mic two, the way. Damn one, it. go. Alternate bringing your knees up to touch the ring con. Make sure your back is straight. Last time. All right. Good. Next is the heel lift. You know, it's stretch. been about weeks since I last played. 
Bring yet the I feel incredibly confident in my abilities on to play this today as compared to upward. most other times when I've been playing this. Last time. All right. Good. Except for the heel lift. That doesn't Next bode well. Next is the back straightening stretch. Take a big step forward and drop your hips. Don't let your knees move too far forward. Make sure your toes are pointed straight ahead of you. Let's do one more of each. All right, good. <sighs> Finally, spread your feet. Raise the ring con above your head and lean to the side. Be sure to keep your lower back straight. Oh. As you exhale, please begin to spine. Move. You need to pop. Let's do one more of each. I feel you wanting to pop. Great job. What's the one you're gonna do today, for example? The hip the overhead hip shake, huh? Ugh. Damn allergies. Them, them, I say. <laughs> okay, so cyclist is open. And it looks like a flying stage. Have you seen my lemons? I want my lemons. <sighs> Ah uh, yes, lovely. A ASDF, how are you doing? Welcome to the stage of dead jokes. I apparently am king of those. Okay, time to run. You did it! You know, I feel like I want to get this out of the way right away. Yeah. Overhead squat. Let's get some of this out of the way right away. Okay, let's move. Open your chest up and raise your arms. Nice. Nicely done. Whew. Okay. It has been a buck. Awesome. Since I've a bit. All right. It has been a bit since so I've done anything with Ring Fit, so I am Great. out of practice. Sharp. Great. Out of practice, so this Fantastic. is probably going to kick my butt. Okay. Hmm. I can remember to do that, actually. Sure, something I would need to add to my titles Very nice. for these Ring Fit streams. Nice. Good job. Amazing. Fine work. Excellent. Excellent. Whew. Nice. Oh, 
My right knee is popping like crazy. Let me get my leg reps in clear quick. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. My brain works great. I forgot that I want to add in, uh, I want to start adding in max difficulty at the end of the titles I give these streams. Because, yeah, huh. no ill will to random passersbys, but... I do get more. Okay, let's select the skill. I do get a little tired of answering that question. There. And ooh. That's perfect. Listen.
up in either, at least. Sweaty mess. Turn your exercise well, into experience points with that a was an awkward finish. Pose. Charge your squad powers, but don't overextend you. Release to victory! <sighs> Only eight minutes, huh? Good, good. Doing good work. Hey, wait. They say arms only. But I definitely did something that wasn't arms only. Huh? Pomegranate juice. I think I've got one. Listen. Let me see. I got some pomegranate from an earlier stage, so I might be able to make one. Oh, that's a blood orange. Pomegranate juice. I'm all ready. Huh. Squeeze. There we go. Way to Why squeeze. I need so much juice? I don't know. This. Oh. Huh. Interesting. I haven't found a lot of figs, but I think I'll actually make one of these. I want to have something with double. I want to have something with double attack up, just in Let's double uh, arm up, mainly for boss time. Because if the pattern's repeating, squeeze. drag out at the end here is going to be red with two health bars, and I would like to own him with all of this. Looks tasty. All singular fig smoothie. Okay, all right, and I can get a pomegranate back by doing this stage. Good, great. I want more figs, though. I want more blood oranges. You ever just crave a blood orange? Alright, 
Kingle Bell. It's just you, me, and these muscles. The muscles are hiding underneath the flap. Don't worry. They're there. Raise and lower your arm. Raise up. Lower down. Didn't get a rush, but that will allow me to have guard. Your legs bend slightly. Squeeze. Like a skill and attack. Eh, I need to do more reps of this. I did like five earlier, so. Okay, let's move. That's a little bit. Yep, that leaves Leslie in the cramping. So let's say, I felt a muscle well or a tendon awesome. round the corner on my bone. And Good sure as heck it did. Because now I'm trying to, because now my legs are trying to cramp up. Snap on my legs Good twice. Oh, well, I missed the mark entirely, didn't I? My friends. Check the enemy's color, then select a skill. Huh. That's a lot of robots. Look at all those Eggman's robots. Warrior two pose. You know, something I gotta ask myself if it's worth it is if I want to rebuy a copy of Sonic Heroes. Most of the time, I say no. Whistle. One second. Slowly return to the starting position. Relax and don't strain your shoulders. And then I tell myself, no, thanks to how the game's structured, I've already played through it. I've already played through Sonic Heroes three and a half times. Thank you, I'll pass. But more and more, I'm finding it harder to deny, to deny or say a no to that question. 
just so I can emphasize how bad the game is. Of course, you never know. Playing Sonic Heroes, I could have an epiphany like I did with Wind Waker where, oh god, this game is actually good. Not really so much an epiphany, but rather just a realization that maybe this game is good and I was too harsh on it. And, or am still harsh on it. I don't know. Time will tell. Okay, let's move. Press in on the ring on as you do that. Perfect! Time will tell what I'll do. Excellent! Because I'm still Start. mentally mentally right now, when it comes to buying the old games. Keep it up. Right now my checklist goes finding a physical version of, Pir nice. of uh, Pirate's Curse. Wonderful. I believe there's Wii U and 3DS physical releases Great. of the game. Awesome. So maybe find s some one of those out there. And then it's to do the whole move all my games from my Wii U over to my over to my Switch. Great. Mainly being Tropical Freeze, Amazing. New Super Mario Brothers U, yes. and yes. uh realized about a week after I made that, that statement of Bayonetta, the Bayonetta combo. Remaster Kickstarter. I moved that to my Switch, so I don't know if I should if I should continue pushing for it with that notion or not. Whether it will be a waste of my time or not. You know, with how much stuff I picked up today in this exact fashion, I'm surprised how much I'm sweating doing this motion. Then again, I don't work out my arms very often. Great. Plenty of subject changes happening because I'm I'm about a week out from my last stream. Increase your pace. Okay. So Great. a lot of stuff will be flying through the air you got it. as I think of it. Week that I haven't had a keep chance to talk about. Fantastic. I'll keep it light because some people are like, oh god, anime, ew. Uh, Genshin Impact. Game's uh, pretty good. You should feel it in your stomach, not your arms. Uh, hi, game. I'm, hi, I'm holding at max velocity. Senor Dumas. I don't want to sit down. I'll struggle through the arm motions rather than sit down. There it goes. And I 
fight it wants to dump, so we have to stand right back up in about 10 seconds' time. That was definitely a lead up for a jump. Drop your hips. But eh. Victory! Stretch for victory. You know what? My pulse is gonna be super fast. Lightly cover the Even though it's my first time doing this in pad of your right thumb has shown. literal in a literal week. But let's see what happens. Measuring. Why not? Please do not move your thumb. I can tell you right now, that's that's 100 calories burned wow. of the bare minimum 250 I try and do. Wow. All right. I was actually just curious if I'm gonna if I'm too low level, then I look at my levels like, oh no, I'm fine. Do I have any oddball smoothies? No, I don't have any. I don't have any strength or defense level up smoothies right now. <laughs> Ring might be an idiot. That's all I'm gonna say. Ring might be an idiot. Oh, pardon me. Sat on it for long enough, and then it finally went at it. Okay, let's move. Lower your body so it's parallel. To the Great, sharp. Good job. Perfect. All right. Amazing. Nice. Now these two, these two will definitely Wonderful. live through my uh, assault. Fine work. Uh, I'm sure. Thank God it is. Yesterday, Very and nice. do not eat well because of that. Fantastic. So, all right, amazing. There is natural methane because you don't know. Great, let's pick up the pace. Fantastic. Okay. I defeated one. I felt the rumble stop and I thought I finished early. Like, no, I didn't finish early. 
And then out of the corner of my eye, I saw, oh, I KO'd one. <sighs> I need some water in me. That one. Holy cow, I tried to breathe without air. I tried to talk without air beside me. Okay. Plan of attack is to front press them in hopes of defeating the uh, healer. Front press. Okay, let's go. Imagine holding something in your arm. And if not, I have some Russian twists in the, in the wings. Great. Perfect. Yes. Yes. Actually, I'll be honest. I'm kind of glad I switched over to... Uh, I, I hate myself all the time, but I'm kind of glad I switched over to the front press. Okay. Over from... Th uh, basically over from... Well, long term. Over from squats. Because I need to work on my arms more than my legs. To a lesser extent, my chest. So, I don't know. I feel like this is going to help in the long run. Rather than try just trying to wimp out and just go, Oh no, all leg exercises, please. Okay. Wonderful. Like, I think my legs are fine in terms of tone. It's my upper body needs some more work. Because, like... Occasionally, when I'm Great. doing my business in the restroom, I'll turn my bot. I'll turn. Great. I'll like turn a heel up for whatever reason, Amazing. and I'll look at my calves like, "Holy cow!" That is definition. My calves are divine. Very are nice. divine and defined. Nice. Now, just to get the rest of me look like that, yes. which doing ring fit. Right. Not exactly the primary way to do that. Maybe in due time, I can invest in a weightlifting set. Hi. Hello, Fede Kamui. How long have I been playing? I think my first play session of this game was back in March. I think it was March. I did my first day, had to rest for five days, then I tried doing every day, uh, annihilated my knees, annihilated my knees after the every day, so I went to every other day, and now I'm doing it like Tuesday, Thursday, I'm really only doing it Tuesdays and Thursdays now, when on the weekends I'm going for a run, instead of playing ring fit. So, Perfect. and that's it with doing all of the side missions, or side modes too in this game. Nicely done. So, I think I've got Fire. over 40 hours clocked in this game now. Very nice. Oh, Let's you did going. your first session today, I'm assuming you did a lot of squats. Great. And hopefully your, your body is familiar Great. with doing lots of squats. You got it. Good. Good. Cause I remember my first, my, my first day, Fire. my first session. It was only like a hundred squats at the end of the t at the end of the session. I say that like it's like it's nothing now, by the way. It was only a hundred squats at the end of the session, but I could not walk properly for for a week. Oh, well, I mean, 
This is a little bit of a spoiler for other things you'll get here, because I don't think I have any exercises here that are on the uh, initial rotations. So kind of this will be a little preview for you as to what you can expect from the game. You actually get pretty early on too. I just like doing this one a lot because it helps uh, sculpt the innards on my legs. Okay. Keep it up. But excuse me. Great. I'm playing at max Amazing. difficulty right now, but I will tell you that I started off on level 21. That's that's uh that's with a year of every day go uh, being on elliptical for an hour and a half to two hours a day. So, Amazing. I had kind of a high bar set for myself because I exercised every day, nice. but Great. just know I didn't start at max difficulty, I worked my way up to it. I should have known. <sighs> I don't want to have to do wide squats unless I have to. Do I have something to just recharge the skill? I'll do more thigh presses. <sighs> yeah. <laughs> I mean, I could say that too, but I also know that is a lie. Uh, do I have anything else to recharge the skill? No, just the arugula? Or mint? Whatever. Um... I say that I'm out of shape now, considering I still have moments when I'm doing it now where I have to stop and breathe for a minute or two. But when I first started, it was terrible. Even with the fact I exercised daily before before I started playing this. Okay, let's go. But um, some exercises that are in here that when I have all classes them that I was doing are um. Work. Keep it up. No, not revolve crystal one right. use. Um, because I have those on my for my one use. Great. Um, awesome. mountain climbers. Good mountain job. climbers are in the game. Perfect. And I was okay. doing those a lot, but damage nice numbers wise, the the Great. the raised Y squat does uh it does more damage well done. at this point in the game. Amazing. I don't think burpees are in here because I don't think they can get Wonderful. they can find a way to have you hold on to the ring con okay. to confirm you're actually, you know, doing a jumping jack. I think that's what a burpee is. Work. And a push-up. Awesome. And a squat. Fantastic. So there's Amazing. no burpees, but there are mountain climbers. Yes. Yes. And I will tell you, mountain climbers suck. But if you want to have see a result Amazing. of calories burned for effort put in, do mountain climbers. The only thing I'll warn you on is the, the, registra oh, the registry right. on Mount Climbers is a little up. iffy. Like, Very you can nice. do it the same way nice. 30 times, and all those 30 times, Eight. half of them will be registered nice as, as good and not great. Fine work. Which, by the way, okay. there is a difference that in this game good. between good and good, good and great. You got it. Damage, all right. well, how your character okay. looks, everything. This great. includes running. When I get to, when I get out of a monster gym, you'll see what I mean. But yeah. Although I will tell you the game. Oh, but yeah, mountain climbers are. It's your difficulty level times two. So if you're on moderate, I'm gonna say you're at like difficulty 17. It would be 34 mountain climbers. One one leg being a mountain climber. Hello, Valkyrian. So like, just to show for well, I can't lay down and show you for example, but like one, two, three, four, that. That's that's what I mean. 
Also, if I predicted you're on difficulty 17, I'm gonna call myself a medium and psycho. Uh, I mean psycho. I mean psychic. Anyway, back to the Russian twist. This one's probably my favorite one to do. Plus, it also works out the fact the fact that all the weight I lost needs to be coming off of someone. Twist. I think I like it so much because it popped my back. Now, if I could find a way to attach a weight to the wing con, maybe I could do that to uh, increase my uh, ferocity in my workout. Oh, um, it's not at a set number of days because I haven't been playing like every day straight, always, but to repeat it, I started in late March, early April, somewhere around there, um, yeah, I started in late March, early April, and when I did my first session, I had to take a week off because I couldn't walk right because I did so many squats. 100 squats back then it is was asking way too much of me now where 100 squats is just like okay so that's two fights where are my other 250 squats but after that I went to every other day for a little while yeah about seven or eight months not every single day because it was once I got back on track, it was alternating ring fit and an elliptical. Then, I tr then my elliptical broke. I tried every day on this. Was was basically ruining the tendons in my knees. So I had to go back to every other day. And now I'm Tuesday, Thursday. I do this. And then Saturday, Sunday, I go for a two-mile run. I've also increased in ferocity as time has gone on. Like I was telling Kamui earlier, I started off at level 21. As the title says, I'm currently level 30. Uh, yeah, I'll get back to that in just a second. Um, yeah, I was 21, I worked my way up to level 30. And even beyond that, I start to like uh, take it a little more seriously and kind of treat this like a proper gym workout rather than just something additional at the end of my workday. Uh, you can kind of see it right now through the sweat on my shirt, but I'm also wearing a sauna vest underneath here, basically to trap all the heat close to my body to promote sweating more. two jobs the life although I do understand that struggle I've got a co-worker that had that struggle and I to a extent have that struggle I mean depends upon what you consider working on YouTube as well mm. I mean I'm in a lucky position where I, I work at it I don't have a lot of responsibilities that I have to take care of and I have a pretty decent paying job so I do get the realization of just working one nine to five job and kind of doing whatever I want after that. So I have the luxury of that. I won't, I won't deny that. But one way you could look at it is if either of your jobs, if either of your jobs are physical labor like mine is, you know you're getting your at least your daily workout in, or at least for one of your two jobs. I'm just crazy and going above and beyond because, Fantastic. well, Sharp. to put it lightly, 
I'm coming back to the knee thing. Hold on. A year and a half ago. Um, a year and a half ago, I was 360 pounds. I'm currently 245. I was 240 at my best, but then quarantine, quarantine happened. Yeah, even with working out, the bad things happened. Uh, kilograms? Uh, if you get, let me do rough calculations. I'm gonna be way off probably because I think okay. it's 1.75. Er, it's 1.7 pounds to the to the kilogram, something like that. Nice. So I think Amazing. I was like 270 kilograms. Alright, increase your weight. No, it's not right. It's well, like 250, 270 kilograms. Nice. I'm probably way off. And I'm down to like 180 Keep now. Roughly. I could look, I could pull up Google if you give me just a minute. Yes. Yes. Very nice. Anyway, so the knee Good thing. Job. Um, okay. I wasn't, I wasn't, uh... Good job. Oh, I am way okay. off. Holy crap. Thank Three. you, Kamui. Come on. So once... Um, yeah. Let me do the Google thing. Hopefully the game won't cut the gun on me. So yeah. I was 163 kilograms. I'm now 111. Alright. Anyway, so after so long, the knee thing. So, while playing this game, you do have to do a lot of squats. Oh, damn it. Gosh dang it. <laughs> Eventually, the game's gonna realize I'm pressing in all, all, as much as I can. Or it won't. Over here, you'll realize it? You're dumb. So... In American pounds, that's 120 pounds lost over the course of a year. Then I gained like 15, 20 back and lost it. So for you, I lost 55 kilograms roughly. Put on like seven and then lost almost all of it. God damn it, Ashley. Hi, Ashley. <laughs> Uh, the knee, again, knee thing. So yeah, playing every day for a while there. You do squats a lot. And the Warrior 2 pose also makes you do squat a lot, even though it's sideways. Um, yeah. So, with all that said, because you were, I'm doing a lot of squats, Doing a lot of squats, and the fact that I'm 240, 250 pounds in that range, con like a constantly bob, bob, bobbing up and down, 110, 120 kilograms, bobbing up and down in that range. Well, if you keep working your legs without any rest, eventually something has to break, and if and it, the body will find the weakest point to break at. So, for me, it was the tendons in my knees. For a long time, I couldn't, I couldn't uh, squat down on this knee without immense pain for a good two weeks. So, I had to back off on uh, how much I played this game for a while. But after some time off, eventually I got full range of motion back without pain.
going to finish the thought here in just a second. Okay, let's switch sides. Don't forget to switch legs. Yeah, the thing is, I'm enjoying it. Like, I do enjoy the game, even though a lot of the mysticism has ebbed off at this point, simply because I've been playing it for seven or eight months at this point. I feel like I'm closing in on the end of the game as is. Because I know somebody, I know one or two of you said you're just starting this. I'm in world 18. That's with doing all of the side missions. Well, as many as I can do because the game does have a little bit of jank to it. Yeah, I'm in 18 and I don't see an end yet. Yeah, one. Uno ocho. We'll go with that. But I still do enjoy, do enjoy the game occasionally. Putting like a finger in the leg. First time? Oh, then you're like in world 11 or 10 or 12, Great somewhere job. around there. Go drink some water. Oh, that was the last fight. You're pretty far in. Oh. But I will say, I do say this constantly when I play this for people watching and being intimidated. Probably anything starting with the probably when I said Spanish for eight. Oh yeah. Um, if you're finding a Lego for the second time, you're probably in world eleven or world eleven or twelve, somewhere in that range. Um at least if I'm thinking correctly. It could be wrong. It's been at least two months since I've been in that area. <laughs> it feels like. Also, the, ri the music rhythm section, I haven't messed around with that too much, actually. Oh, good, it's just a teleport back. But, as I tell people who are watching, you know, who have been playing Ring Fit for a while, who are first-time players, or even are seasoned players, don't follow exactly my footsteps. I'm crazy. Typically, the game tries to stop you somewhere around 10 to 15 minutes to ask you if you want to keep going or not. So, when I do it, that number on the left there, I try to have that read about 40 to 50 minutes for the clock. And or have this read 250 or more. So don't do what I do, because I know I'm crazy. Uh, yes. Uh, is it K calories for European areas? Or I guess everything outside of states? If uh, outside of America it does K calories or what. As much as I am in the online spheres, I don't know. I don't know measurements for everybody outside the US, even though I try to accommodate. It says blueberry smoothie.
black currants. Actually, I need some of those. Okay, hold on. I want to make some of these just for my own necessities. I'm all ready. Yeah, we gotta keep in mind that timer shows like active Whee! time playing. It doesn't show like your current time doing everything else because it doesn't count this this stuff like making smoothies or anything like that into that. Because like that timer over there, it says 27 minutes. I've been streaming for an hour. Uh, but something I will say for you guys watching out there Squeeze. who are new viewers to all this. Uh, who are new viewers to what I do. I'm Squeeze. sure you guys can hear the game just fine. I cannot. Because how I have my sound set up is it goes through these wireless headphones. And I'm not going to wear my only wireless headphones while I'm exercising. So the volume is just cranked on this over here on this side. Um, it can help you lose weight, but I will also tell you a proper diet will help you lose weight as well. All the weight I lost happened before I got ring fit. And how I lost all my weight is I basically survived on a diet of like 50% egg, 40% lunch meat, and 10% everything else. Right. Proteins. Like, what was my... Let me see. I still do this first part, but wake up in the morning. Wake up in the morning, have two eggs for breakfast. Lunch, I either have a can of soup, around 300 calories, or a, san or a sandwich with bread, minus cheese, to be about 300 to 350 calories. By the way, if you like mustard, that helps a lot because there's no calories in mustard, most mustards. And then for dinner, I kind of did whatever while being conscious about what I was eating. Ask away. Also, this, this will let me emphasize what I mean by running has a physical, has a like visual difference between doing it good and doing it great. Keep asking your question, by the way. I will answer as soon as I can throughout this. Um, I think that's a case. Dang it, I missed one. Oh, shoot. Well. Um, so yes, in a sense, it does. Realigned. Um, I am no health field expert, so I don't know how much truth there is to that statement. Okay, let's fly. Ooh. I don't know how much truth there is to that statement myself. I just knew eating a lot of breads is a bad idea, because bread has a lot of carbohydrates in it, and that does translate to fat pretty, pretty efficiently if you don't burn it off. Protein? It's not as bad. You did it. Mono? Like mononucleosis or something? <laughs> same way a carbohydrate does oh no no I didn't say monocarbohydrates 
I just said carbohydrates, singular. Like all forms of carbohydrates. That's why. Um, I don't know if it's a craze uh, in areas outside of America, but uh, ketosis, a uh, ketosis diet, is basically a diet that abolishes all carbohydrates and or, or otherwise known as sugars from your diet. tell you about keto is because I've got two friends who are on it right now I got yeah and you might know this much as well the thing with ketosis is when you get on it unless you stay almost religious to it or, or ease back off of it very 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 slowly you gain all that weight back because you're basically saying no bread Bread holds a lot of water. And you drink water to rehydrate yourself, especially uh, if you're working out or not. So, like, if you ask that friend, a uh, colleague at work, you know, if they have a cheat weekend, you can ask them how much they think they gain. But I will tell you, two days not following keto after months of following it, it's 20 pounds back on. Just like that. So it's a very dangerous it's a very dangerous game to play. You lose a lot fast. But unless you stick to it, you gain it back just as fast. Uh 12 uh, 8 kilograms. Sorry, I need to remember. You're not not US based. <laughs> Option for just about every food you can have, except for bread, except for like loaves of bread. Yes. Yes. But everything else, you know, well done. there are keto friendly options Wonderful. for just about everything. Okay. But Perfect. you will be paying the price if you do go for those because they require more Amazing. meticulous care to get to the store and also in pre and pre uh, preparation as well. Why, when my friends said they were starting keto, no, it's okay. When my friends say they were starting keto, like I did a little research on it myself, just like, okay, what does, what's the benefit of this? I ran into what I couldn't have if I was on keto, and then later found out the dangers of going off of keto. I was like, and I just went, no, I'll just straight start counting my calories. That's it. And well. That's where we see me at today. About 20, about 20, 25 slash 10 to 12 kilograms off of my ideal weight for my body type. It, I can I'll repeat as much as you need me to say. Okay. I'm gonna get a slow on, night where you're working. Okay, let's switch sides. Um oh yeah. Okay, so I read up on, I read on, I read up on keto, you know, the benefits of it. And then later on I learned the detriment of breaking the keto diet. And I decided to stick with straight counting calories instead of going with ketosis. Or keto. Excellent. Excellent. Wonderful. Great. Perfect. Uh, like average human body. Nice. 
uh, with keto. Or stick with what I've been doing, which is not really a diet. Amazing. Okay. What I'm doing is not, what I did was not really a diet. It was more or less a rough outline of foods I could stop eating to get better. Arms tired, hold on. Here, I'll get closer. So, like, for about a year, I cut out all sugars. I stopped drinking soda, period. I went cold turkey on it and had to deal with the lovely caffeine, caffeine migraines. Um, I cut down on my bread. I didn't cut it out, but I cut down on my bread. And for a lot of things that required uh, vegetable oil for cooking, I substituted in spray oils, like Pam or you know, basically just a basic cooking spray. But I think olive oil has just as many calories as any other or, uh, cooking oils. Very nice. Fantastic. But I think I looked it up at one point. Excellent. Out of curiosity. it is, you know, if you consider it to be, go for it. With your legs bent slightly Far be it from a stranger on the internet to stop you from doing what you think is good. <sighs> what are we at? Oh, I can't see it right now. Um, I'm going to kick my own ass for a minute. Let me look at this here. Well, no. A lot of times when I cook stuff that uses oil, I will use the recommended dosage. I don't add more. In fact, sometimes I even add less. But um, at this point, I've, for the most part, stopped dieting and just been working out more. So I'm still losing weight, but instead of being five pounds a week or one to two kilos a week, it's like one, one to two pounds a week or up to a kilo at most. And keep in mind, that's at most. Also, salads. Okay, let's move. This will target your back. Fine work. Sharp. Great. Like, no cheese, don't use ranch. Nice. Yeah, I'm slowing down, but I'm close keep enough to... Up. Eh, kind of. I'm close enough to my goal. And my body has adjusted to the... To not needing as many calories that you know weaning myself off my diet hasn't really hurt me really like here I still eat junk food I eat junk food now again pretzels and stuff like this I still eat junk food but because my body is not like in a constant need for this and I tell myself I need to eat X amount of vegetables a week and X amount, you know, and avoid X amount of stuff. No, I don't. I don't need it. I don't need it. It's a craving. <laughs> I mean, sugar in doses does help with working out, but it is very, it is very limited doses. Like I said, I'm Wonderful. close to my target. I'm close to my target weight, and I'm I am very very cautious about going below my target weight because if I do go below that, I'll start looking malnourished. Because I mean, you can look at me right now. Most of what I have on is pretty close to skin tight as is. 
my body frame and my, my, my entire family's body frame is wide structured. Like, both of my, well, excluding my eldest sister, every, everybody in my family has a wide skeletal frame. She got the recessive genes and she's built like a twig. <laughs> So, like, you gotta account for your own, like, family genealogy when saying, you know, here's my target weight. Because a lot of, like, doctors and online weight calculations will offer you because it doesn't know your genealogy. A physician, a uh, licensed physician may know better, but just, like, going online, going to target weight or height or something like that it'll be off because it can't calculate you know your skeletal structure or anything like that like like I would show you but twitch would be very mad that I basically have ribs I basically have you know skeletal ribs right now and a, and a meat flap we'll say As disgusting as it is, a meat flap. So like, except for my gut, I'm pretty much toned how I want to be. I just have to wait for the excess skin to fall off my gut. Amazing. For the most part. Great. Amazing. But I am also not young anymore, so I do need to work out daily as well. Great. Yeah, like, it is my limit. It's also the fact that I haven't done a lot of chest exercises, so I don't have a lot of muscle there either. But if you build muscle, you, you will always add weight. So, like, for me, I think... Like, for me, I think... My target weight, given my body structure, at six foot two or just over two meters tall, is about 220 pounds or 105 kilos. So that's roughly my ideal weight, I think. I should see a physician to get it actually nailed down, but uh, that involves going to a doctor. <laughs> And I have, I'm weird about going to doctors. Not that I have medical issues, really. Good job. I've just always been weird about going to doctors. Because I always feel like it's, some of what they say is uh, hollow. Some of what they say is kind of monkish. And I think most of that came about with a lot of my dentistry work growing up. Because the dentist would say, you know, oh, you need these cavities filled coming in a cup. Or you need Excellent. these cavities filled coming in a week. And say, okay, come back in a month, and we're going to put a cap on those cavities. Why? You just filled the cavity. <laughs> it's kind of like this that whole, you took the one step, why do we need an additional step? When I'm following what you say. I know, kind of more or less like a, I'm getting ripped off, because... Fine work. <laughs> I mean, not to be rude, but reminder, I'm in America, yes. Yes. where that stuff is not free. Amazing. Going to going to a doctor to get your temperature taken because you think you might have the flu, that's 20 bucks or 17 pounds flush quid. All right. Something like that. Challenge yourself. Excellent. Yeah. Healthcare ain't free in America. Good it should be, but it's not. <laughs> my cynicism make you afraid to go to the doctor because that's why I'm afraid to go to the doctor because extra money but just that's kind of why you know 
forgive me for getting political about Kyrians, but that's why in America so many people have problems going to the doctor and staying healthy because every time they go to the doctor, they're looking at on average like a hundred dollars, a hundred quid or pounds going to the, going to see a doctor. Just tell them, have them say, yeah, do this, this, and that. Okay, bye. So I mean, I mean, you take it as a blessing because I mean, it's a blessing here a little bit because we don't pay taxes, that high of taxes I don't think compared to the rest of the world, but we also don't get free health care. Yeah, most people have, like, most people that get good paying jobs or get well positioned jobs get, uh, Get their me get their medical stuff paid out of paid out of their paycheck or their taxes from their paychecks. So higher paying po or better positions in a company get that. But if you're someone like me or lower who doesn't get that benefit, you have to pay uh, because of how uh, fair was it the oh god what is it how medical rights work in America right now where you're not where you're not getting free health insurance but because you are by law required to have health insurance you get some assistance paying for it out of pocket Excellent. like it's all awesome. income based on uh, based on your taxes you file okay. but depending upon Money. which tax bracket you and you pay 60 or you pay 30 to 40 percent of your health care plan every month like normal out of pocket and if you don't and if you don't you, if you don't have a health care plan you can get fined on your taxes Great. Wonderful. Well, that's why it's stupid because you're forced to have the health insurance even if you don't use it because if you don't have it you get fined And it's not like a once in a lifetime finding either. It's a, okay, well the first year you don't have health insurance, you could find $250 in your taxes. Then it's 500. Then it's 1,000. Then it's 2,000. Yeah, part of ours go to our health system, but not all of it. Yeah, it's kind of screwed up. It, Health insurance is kind of screwed up here. That's why if you ever watch the news for, from the American side, you public health care is kind of a hot button topic because America is one of like four nations that don't have public health care. So those other three nations being like small Lithuanian nations like Syria or something like that. going around of COVID, that's why so many people are dying in America, because we don't have a public health system to help identify COVID, or we don't have an easy way to identify uh, cases of COVID quickly, because all that money is not being used to help with COVID relief. It's used to pad pockets, we'll say. No, yeah, like... If healthcare was included on taxes, I'd be more willing to go and take care of it. But because I'm paying out of pocket for almost everything, no. <laughs> that is the million dollar question, Valkyrian. We don't know what the taxes are being used for that aren't going to our healthcare. Okay, let's go. Hold the ring con like a bow. Good job! Awesome! Great! Amazing! 
most of it goes to our to our military, which we don't really need because there's genuine there's borderline world peace. Okay. Wonderful. Great. Alright. Excellent. Again, I apologize for talking uh, politics so much but this, and what I say may not be 100% factual I may be I may be fabricating some parts of what I'm saying yeah on top of what power though when there's no power to stay on top of me everybody's pretty much kind of on equal footing like the numbers I'm going to give I have no idea if they're true or not but the U.S. budgeted, like, multiple billions of dollars for COVID relief uh, finances and everything like that. I believe $1.1 billion went to military. Politics because everybody, not everybody is here to talk politics while watching some guy Way play a video game about sweat. working out. Drop your hips. <laughs> yeah. Whew. But yeah, I I keep my I try to keep my nose out of politics because nobody likes to have an influencer spout politics constantly. Quote, quote unquote, me being an influencer, I just do stuff for fun. I'm not an influencer. Yeah. <laughs> uh, difficulty level? Shoot, that's not what I want to do. Uh, difficulty level. How do you do that from here? Not this one. Oh, character level. Well, there's that. Um, 175. Uh, I think this will probably be my last level for today, unless something pops up randomly. But I do plan to like clean up, have something to eat, and then move on to something a little bit extra at the end of the stream here. But, yeah. Oh yeah, um, there are armor combinations you can get and smoothies you can get to give your, or uh, drinks you can get to make your level skyrocket. Come on, let's run. Like, I don't think you've come across Silver Hoplins yet. But Silver Hoplins are basically the metal, metal slimes or the EXP farm of this game. And there are EXP boosting uh, equipment. Oh, you have. But yeah, there's EXP boosting equipment and, uh... You got it. Yeah, they are rare. Uh, EXP boosting equipment okay. and drinks. Let's select a skill. Also, I don't think you've I, you've probably seen these megafauna guys, the megafaunas, or whatever they call them in over there in the UK. Um, if they're left alone and they resummon an enemy, they have a chance to resummon gold or silver hoplins. Gold or silver hoplins also spawn on the overworld map. And. But if you ever prepare yourself enough, you can get stuff like, you can get goodies like this to double experience or to double money. Which I would recommend you save until you find gold and silver hoplins. There's also equipment you can wear that give you like a 5% experience bonus. But also keep in mind, I don't know about you, but keep in mind, I have also done every single side mission I could. Okay, let's move. Don't let um, your face get stuck in the 
you do and you don't. Like the resources that drop are kind of random. But um, there are drinks that double, that can double the amount of drops that you receive. So one yogurt becomes two, one grape becomes two, stuff like that. Keep mind, I haven't made every smoothie I can yet. Fantastic. I'm only making ones that are just like, nice. yeah, it looks like that'll work. And I don't abuse these smoothies either. Unless Good I'm in a boss fight. Yeah, the sesame smoothie. And Very I think nice. you're... I think you're getting close to uh, finding me cabbage soy smoothie, which is the same thing. Excellent. Awesome. I've run out of all my double Great. double drop stuff, and I haven't made any more. Oh, done. Well done. Oh, I haven't. I've only repeated unless it was a side uh, a side quest. I haven't. Re I've only repeated one stage because I was below the level it was recommended, and that was at the very beginning. use healing skills like you've seen my rotation you see my rotation as I've gone through and done fights I have zero healing skills and I only ever use them if the game forces me to do it at like a strength team or something like that because how I have it organized right now in my set is oh it's fine I don't really use healing skills like period what I have is my first four skills are my wide attacks of each element my next four skills are single target of every element, and then favorites, the last two, which you can unlock these later on. And I suppose I could put a healing skill down the far end, but I'm headstrong. Why heal when I can do more damage and have a smoothie to heal me regardless? Right here. Look at this crap. Look at this. I've still got a... Uh, is that spinach up there? No, it's arugula. I've 
Okay, I must have run out of them. For a while, I had some spinach smoothies back here. Still, and I must have used them all up finally. I still have a Crest smoothie. When arugula is currently top dog. It's all about picking your skills properly. Uh, okay, yes. Don't to but then sides. I found stuff like planks. And I probably and I probably am doing it wrong. But I found stuff like planks I tried to do. Couldn't do them because I think I've got scars now on my elbows. Because though I'm not so much fat anymore, I still weigh a bit. And I'm doing this over carpet. So even with a yoga mat. Even with a yoga mat, it tears up my elbows and leaves me with scabs. <laughs> so I had to stop doing planks. But I try to I try not to do easy exercises because that is less calories burned and less strenuous, so in turn less calories burned. Also, I kinda move my head. I focus on my shoulders and me twisting my arms when I do this one. Because how it says for the tool tip on how to do this is imagine opening your collarbone. So, open, close. Kind of like that. It just let the head tilt comes with it. Imagine opening your collarbone to the right and the left. Watch tip on the side there, on the left. Excellent! Oh. <laughs> oh. My legs, the hurt. With your legs bent slightly, squeeze. There you go. So yeah, it's just, it is, you know, like they say, opening up the collarbone and closing it. It feels weird and it looks even weirder, but that's how you're supposed to do it for the most part. I'm doing this. I don't want to do squats. <laughs> I'm gonna be doing plenty more for the end of this, I can already tell.
good. The ultimate thing you take away from this is persistence. Persistence does wonder for you. Also, if it pulls up your switch, then it stops. Then it will start recognizing your Joy-Con inputs. There were a couple of those where it came out a second or two after I finished the motion. No, that's fine. I can't lift him any higher. Come on, man. Yep, that means it's working. I'm hella tired. Well, that's a good thing. Dang it, missed one. Score! There's the end. I also tend to do Slav squats, as I'll call it. <laughs> yeah! I got bit. Thank you, Valkyria. I got and bit. <laughs> Not to discredit the bits. It's just a funny joke. <sighs> Calling it there. That's right about where I want to end, I think. Perfect. That's on par with my other sessions. Although I will say, I had one session where I went for 52 minutes and I almost burned 400 calories. I was dead at the end of that day. Uh, I did something good. Oh god. I think I like Russian twists. <laughs> no, that's fine. Do what you gotta do to keep yourself healthy, Valkyrian. I am gonna I am gonna have an away time here while I go um clean up and grab myself something to eat and I'll have like a sit down chat moment for a little bit. But if you need to be done, if you need to be going to sleep for your next business work day, don't let me keep you up. <sighs> yeah, <laughs> get some sleep if you when you can. Um, although I will say. Uh, Let's begin our study I do this special. stuff you won't need the my days. Time. I try to do Tuesday, Thursday, Saturdays. And stretch within the range of your ability. 
stretch your left arm to the yeah. side and hold it. I do Tuesday, right Thursday, arm. Saturdays for Pull my streams. Not all of them the are ring fit streams. Left shoulder. Um, but if you don't mind me plugging, I have other stuff down below that has archive. I have on the a Twitch side. archive channel. And I also have a not to rotate Let's Play channel down there if you want to watch more edited stuff or stuff that can be watched at your at your leisure. Everything that goes up on Twitch gets put up on those channels. Everything that goes up on Twitch goes up on the archive moment. channel unedited. Put your hands on your lower back as if supporting it. Gently tilt your upper body backward, but don't lean back more than is comfortable. Holding your lower back with your palms will stabilize it. Bring yourself back slowly. Spread your feet, raise both hands, and hold your left wrist. Yeah, no rush on it. While I figured I'd just say wrist, something if you're enjoying yourself. Right and stretch your side. Cause you know, making content, you gotta, you gotta, you gotta plug yourself like a shape before. There's the follow. Switch hands huh. and bend the other. Forget my terrible German, but donkey shame, my friend. I was probably wrong, Stretch but it's the slowly. only German I've Don't ever been taught. <laughs> Bring yourself back slowly. <laughs> Bring your feet together and loosen up. Bend your body forward to stretch your lower back and the backs of your thighs. Oh. It was Hold just sonic. Like that for it was a just a sonic longer. gif of him waving. Bend your knees slightly and raise your body bit by bit uh, from the lower back until you're upright. It's just a follow notification. I have notifications for most things set up. Oh boy, I need a chair. Because my balance is terrible. Pull your knee backward and stretch the front of your thigh. Case in point, I have to move the chair over here so I don't fall. Now do the same on the opposite side. My right foot balance, I should, should say, is terrible. My left foot, not, not as bad. Anyway. So. That will do it for the ring fit Bring session. Back now, as I've said twice and now. Your stretching is complete. Good job. Uh, that's going to do it for the ring fit session. Uh, I will be going to Twitter in just a moment to see what the poll said for what to do for a little bit of extra stream time tonight. But in the interim, no, I do not. Uh, I will be honest with you, Vakurian. And forgive my French. Forgive my cursing to a certain extent. I'm a bitch. I don't, uh, I don't, I generally don't play scary games because I get scared too easily. And if I don't get scared, I aggressively get more and more angry waiting for the scare. So it's not fun to watch. In, uh, in long term, it's not fun to watch because I don't anticipate the scare as being a scare. I anticipate the scare as a, oh, finally. Anyway. Let me put up my AFK screen, put on some music, and I'll be back to you guys in about half an hour or so with my dinner. As soon as I unplug, un un unplug myself from the ring fits set up. Eh, it depends upon the person. I'm just off screen here. Um, I think the thing is, is a person's natural fear of water because from what I know of Subnautica, Shark attacks, deep sea creatures attacks, and they kind of, yeah, so, anyway, let's do a screen swap.